Hey, this is Anthony with Revzilla TV, where you can watch, decide, and ride. Welcome to our detailed breakdown of the new Ruka Queen Gore-Tex glove, available at Revzilla.com. So as you can see, the Ruka Queen is a ladies' glove. I am not wearing it, but I'm going to walk you through it. It's really the complement to the men's R-Star, which is a very unique Gore-Tex glove, over $200 from Ruka. The beauty of this glove is it's a three-season cold weather glove, but you're able to tune it on the fly. So it's Gore-Tex, waterproof, breathable, guaranteed for life. That never goes away. But the coolest feature about the Queen, just like the men's R-Star, is the two-chamber construction. You can see it right here. I'm going to roll this cuff back, and you're going to see this tab that leads you to two chambers, and both chambers are fleece lined. The difference is that tab is a layer of fleece that runs through the middle, and it's a thin layer, so what it allows you to do is put your hand under it if you're riding heated grips or if it's the spring or the fall, more temperate riding, and you want to move that extra insulation away from the grip part of your hand or away from the palm of your hand to the back of your hand and give yourself a little bit more room to operate. Now, when it gets really, really nasty cold and you want that full insulation, now you put your hand on the top side of the chamber, you've moved fleece to the palm, and you have a fully insulated glove throughout that's never lost or or changed any of its waterproof qualities. And remember, the breathability factor of the waterproof um, Gore-Tex membrane means that it's always gonna allow your hand to breathe as well, regardless of what chamber you're using. So if your hand starts to sweat, that sweat can evaporate out through the gloves. Beautiful, beautiful in its design. Now I will say this, I don't wear a lady's glove, you know this. And really, when you think about this glove compared to the men's R-Star, what it's going to be is ergonomic for a lady fit. Now we have Allie and some of our other female geeks that have tried it on, our other female riders internally. You know, this is a size nine from me, and what you see typically from a lady's glove is a little bit more narrow through the knuckle and a little bit longer into the fingers. And this glove hits that ergonomically. Now if you are concerned, ladies out there, remember we do ship for free over 39 bucks, so this guy would ship for free, and our returns policy super, super painless if you need to send it back to us. You know, the other thing to keep in mind too is as I walk through this glove, now I'm gonna walk through some of the nitty gritty. Click here, subscribe to us on YouTube, leave us your comments, your questions, or your feedback for you lady riders out there. We'd love to be able to answer them on the fly or hear your gut reaction. Now main construction here on the Queen. Cowhide, it's leather throughout this glove. Main construction, there's no textile on this bad boy. This is a bomb-proof adventure multi-season glove. You're gonna see wrist adjuster on the back of the hand, articulated stretch panel here below the knuckle for free range of motion. Hard shell knuckle that is gonna be an ergonomic knuckle. Sit over the knuckles, that's a crash protection option. That's nice, remember, you're riding in an outfit designed for the crash, not designed for the ride, but it has to be comfortable. And you'll see mid-digitally, that's one color here, you have these high-vis accents, and you have some temper foam panels on the knuckles really subtly to tie things together. Now as I rotate towards the inside, visor wiper on the finger, and that's a left side only. You know, your hand's gonna be on the throttle, left side goes up, fixes your visor. And then moving to the palm, Articulation in the thumb, you have a Clarino reinforcement panel here in the control area, some Clarino with silicon panels here on the tips of the fingers for better grip. And what I do really like about it is this slider. So that's a palm slider that's seated over top of a foam leather layer for vibration dampening, but you'll see it starts on the heel of the hand, works its way laterally, again, giving you that low side protection option there and moving its way down here into the cuff. Now the cuff's kind of that two function cuff, which is going to be able to be wrapped tightly enough to get under a jacket, but also plenty roomy enough to go over a jacket. Really depends on your riding position, depends on, your, on how you ride. The key takeaway though for this glove, for Sport touring, multi-season touring, hardcore adventure touring, this is an apex product in the ladies category, giving you that mild season to cold season functionality. Remember, here in the Ladies Queen GTX from Ruka. The next step in your journey is to click right here and read other lady rider reviews at revzilla.com. You don't have to take my word for it, just use this video as a starting point. If you don't wanna make the investment, if you don't need the two chambers, remember you can always step back to something like the Vilma GTX, which is an extra fit, more um, hardcore touring glove from Ruka that doesn't have that two chamber. So it's a little bit less technical or functional, but again, still great protection and weatherproofness. From here, if you still have questions, shoot our Gear Geeks line, see us at RevZilla.com or 877-792-9455. Thanks for watching our detailed breakdown of the Ruka Queen Gore-Tex 2-in-1 glove, available at RevZilla.com. I'm Anthony. We'll see you next time.